Who was Hermes Trismegistus? Was he a real person? A mythological figure? Or something in between? These are the questions that have puzzled researchers and seekers for centuries. Hermes Trismegistus is a figure who appeared in ancient Egypt and became a central figure in Hellenistic and Roman religion, philosophy, and mysticism. He was believed to be an Egyptian priest and sage enlightened in writing, magic, and wisdom. And his teachings are preserved texts that form the basis of various philosophical systems known as Hermetism. But why does Hermes Trismegistus continue to be a figure of interest today? Some argue that it's because of his association with ancient wisdom and esoteric tradition. Others believe that his teachings contain hidden knowledge that could unlock the secrets of the universe. Whatever the reason, it cannot be denied that Hermes Trismegistus has captured the imagination of people from different cultures and historical periods. In this video, we will look at his life and teachings, as well as the controversies and mysteries surrounding his figure. We will delve into the historical background and evolution of Hermes Trismegistus, as well as the influence of the texts of the Corpus Hermeticum on Renaissance humanism, art, and science. We will also look at his various interpretations and reinterpretations of Hermes in modern times, from conspiracy theories to New Age spirituality. Historical Context To truly understand the enigmatic figure of Hermes Transmagestus, we must go back in time to ancient Egypt. According to the myth, he is a priest and sage gifted with a special gift for writing spells and wisdom. He was revered for his knowledge and was believed to be the author of a large number of texts that dealt with everything from medicine and philosophy to astrology and alchemy. But who was Hermes Trismegistus historically? Some researchers believe that he was actually an historical figure, a priest or a scholar who lived in Egypt during the Hellenistic period. Others argue that he's a composite figure, a synthesis of the Greek god Hermes and the Egyptian Thoth, who have similar qualities and are associated with writing, magic, and wisdom. Despite the lack of concrete evidence, the texts in the Corpus Hermeticum attributed to Hermes Transmagestus offered a fascinating insight into the mindset and worldview of the ancient Egyptians. These texts are a collection of esoteric, and philosophical treaties that explore the nature of the universe, the soul, and the divine. They provide insight into a unique and compelling worldview that viewed all things as interconnected and embodied with meaning. Hermes Trismegistus as a figure that has continued to captivate people for centuries. Even in the modern age, his teachings and ideas continue to be fascinating and relevant. In fact, the New Age movement has adopted many of his ideas, especially the emphasis on the importance of the soul and the power of the mind. Although the origins of Hermes Trismegistus and his role in ancient Egypt remain shrouded in mystery, his legacy has left an imprint on human history, and his teachings continue to inspire and fascinate people to this day. During the Hellenistic period, his figure evolved to become more than a priest of scripture magic and wisdom. He is associated with various teachings and philosophies attributed to him, including astrology, alchemy, and occultism, and is recorded in the texts of the Corpus Hermeticum. During the Roman Empire, the texts of the Corpus Hermeticum gained popularity and were translated into Latin, spreading them throughout Europe. The figure of Hermes Trismegistus became even more popular during the Renaissance, when researchers became interested in rediscovering ancient wisdom and esoteric knowledge. However, it is important to note that the exact origin and historical validity of Hermes Trismegistus is still a matter of debate and speculation. Some scholars believe that he is a real historical figure, while others suggest that he is a mythical creature that evolved over time. Regardless of his true origins, his figure continues to excite people to this day, and his teachings and philosophies continue to be studied 
and researched even today. The texts in the Corpus Hermeticum and the teachings of Hermes Trismegistus. The texts in the Corpus Hermeticum, which are the main source of information about the teachings of Hermes Trismegistus, are a collection of treaties and dialogues written in Greek and Egyptian between the first and third centuries. They contain a rich body of philosophical, religious, and mystical ideas, which have influenced Western thought and spirituality for centuries. One of the fascinating mysteries surrounding the text in the Corpus Hermeticum is how they were preserved and passed down through the centuries. The texts are believed to have been written on papyrus scrolls, which were fragile and prone to decay. However, they survived and were transcribed by scribes and scholars throughout the centuries. One theory is that the texts in the Corpus Hermeticum were preserved and handed down by a secret society or spiritual brotherhood, such as the Egyptian priesthood or Gnostics. According to the theory, these groups viewed the text in the Corpus Hermeticum as a repository of sacred knowledge and sought to preserve and transmit them for future generations. Another theory is that the texts in the Corpus Hermeticum were preserved and transmitted by individual scholars and intellectuals who recognized their value and importance. The texts are believed to have been part of a wider movement of syncretism in which different philosophical and religious traditions merge. The texts in the Corpus Hermeticum are thought to have been influenced by a variety of sources, including Egyptian religion, Greek philosophy, and Jewish mysticism. The texts describe a universe that's filled with divine intelligence and governed by natural laws. They also describe a spiritual path that involves the transformation of the individual soul and the attainment of knowledge and wisdom. Hermetism and the Renaissance The rediscovery of the text to the Corpus Hermeticum during the Renaissance marked a turning point in the history of Western thought and culture. The text profoundly influenced the Renaissance humanism, art, and science, and played a key role in the emergence of a new intellectual and cultural paradigm that emphasized the power of reason and knowledge. The texts were first translated into Latin in the 15th century by Marcello Ficino, philosopher, theologian, astrologer, and one of the most influential thinkers of the Italian Renaissance. He was inspired by the ideas and teachings in the Corpus Hermeticum. Ficino's translations and commentaries on the texts became a major source of inspiration for Renaissance humanists and helped shape their visions of the world and human nature. Renaissance artists such as Botticelli, Michelangelo, and Leonardo da Vinci were also deeply influenced by Hermetic philosophy, which emphasized the beauty and harmony of the natural world, as well as the divine nature of creativity and imagination. Hermetism also had a significant influence on Renaissance science, especially in the fields of astronomy and astrology. The Hermetic idea of the unity of the cosmos and the correspondence between the macroism and the microism inspired new approaches to the study of the natural world and the human body. The influence of the Corpus Hermeticum during the Renaissance was so profound that some scholars argued that the Hermetic tradition played a key role in the emergence of modern science, art, and culture. During the Renaissance, the figure of Hermes Trismegistus became a symbol of the rival of ancient wisdom and esoteric knowledge. The rediscovery of the text in the late Middle Ages and the translation of these works into Latin and other European languages were key factors in the rival of interest in Hermetism. The texts, which contain mystical and philosophical teachings attributed to Hermes Trismegistus, are seen as a valuable source of knowledge that can help bridge the gap between ancient and modern science. Renaissance scholars were particularly attracted to the Hermetic idea of the unity of all things, which offered a new perspective on the nature of reality and the relationship between the individual and the cosmos. Moreover, the Hermetic tradition is associated with the idea of the Prisca theology, or ancient theology, according to which there is a universal and imperishable wisdom that has been handed down by the first humans and is now being rediscovered. Hermes Trismegistus is considered one of the key figures in this ancient wisdom, 
and his teachings are a valuable source of spiritual and intellectual insight. However, the rival of Hermetism during the Renaissance was not without controversy. Some scholars are critical of the texts in the Corpus Hermeticum, claiming that they are dubious origin and heavenly influence by Neoplatonic and other Hellenic philosophies. Others viewed Hermetism as a dangerous form of magic or superstition and accused it and its adherents of being heretics or even devil worshippers. Despite these criticisms, the influence of Hermes Trismegistus and the Hermetic tradition continued to grow throughout the Renaissance and beyond. Trismegistus today remains a powerful symbol of the eternal quest for knowledge and understanding, and his teachings continue to inspire and intrigue scholars, artists, and spiritual seekers around the world. Contemporary Speculation and Controversy Hermes Transmagestes continues to be the subject of fascination and speculation even today, evoking a wide range of interpretations and beliefs. One of the most significant areas of interest in this field is of alchemy. Alchemists saw in Hermes Transmagestes the embodiment of the knowledge and secrets that could lead to the transformation of base metals into gold, as well as the attainment of spiritual enlightenment. Hermes Trismegistus is also associated with astrology and the study of the heavens, where his teachings are interpreted as a means of understanding the hidden influence of the stars and the planets. In the world of the occult, it is seen as a powerful symbol of esoteric knowledge and intuition, and its teachings are used as a means of unlocking the hidden potential of the human mind. Despite the enduring fascination with Hermes Trismegistus, there is much controversy surrounding his origins and teachings. Some have questioned the authenticity of the texts in the Corpus Hermeticum, suggesting they may be the work of later authors rather than Hermes Trismegistus himself. Others debate whether Hermes Trismegistus is a historical or mythical figure, suggest that he may be based on a real person or a composite of several different figures. In recent years, Hermes Trismegistus has also been interpreted in popular culture, conspiracy theories, and a New Age spirituality. Some suggest that he may have been a member of a secret society, while others use his teachings as a means to promote their own spiritual beliefs and practices. Overall, the figure of Hermes Trismegistus continues to be the subject of both research and popular speculation. Although much of his life and teachings remain a mystery, his lasting legacy as a symbol of esoteric knowledge and spiritual enlightenment is a testament to the enduring power of his ideas. Despite the mysteries and controversies surrounding his persona, one thing is clear. He continues to fascinate people across cultures and historical periods. Perhaps it is his mysterious teachings or his association with magic or esoteric knowledge that make him such an attractive figure. Whatever the reason, the lasting legacy of Hermes Transmagistus ensures that he will continue to be a subject of interest and speculation for many years to come. If you like this video, share it with your friends. Don't forget to support us by pressing the subscribe button.